here they are for one and all The moments are about to call Come on and sit down here with me They're here for you on your TV They are the moments They are the moments So come with me, give me your hand I'll take you up to moving land You can fly just like a bird And sing the best song ever heard There were the moments 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 Once again, it's been raining heavily in Moomin Valley. Not enough for a flood this time, but quite enough for everyone to be in extra good spirits when the rain finally stops and the sun comes out again. Oh, silly. Oh, silly. Oh, Sniff, Moomin, and Snork Maiden, of course. They behave as if they hadn't met before. But you're supposed to be silly when in love. Oh. One day it'll happen to you, little Mai. I certainly hope not, and there's no one around to fall in love with anyway. Moomin Papa loves Moomin Mama. The Hemulin's too old for me. The Inspector's not bad, but he loves Mumble. Snuffkin's all right, I suppose, but he's always on his travels. And that leaves... Mm. Who? Well, not the most charming creature I ever met. And what does that mean? I want to be wooed, not slobbered over, and I want lots of presents. Presents? <laughs> Can you see me wooing someone and giving them flowers and chocolates? I like chocolate myself. I certainly wouldn't want to share them with anyone else. Well, that figures. That was very good. I'll be off now. Where are you going? <laughs> I'm not telling. Would you be looking for gold by any chance? Huh? How did you know? Nothing else stops you sleeping after lunch. Little Mai, promise not to tell a soul. I heard there's gold to be found in the mountain stream up north. There's no more gold left around here. You can thank Booble for that. This gold, it gets hold of you. Where is Sniff off to all of a sudden? He's gone off to get over his love for me. Really? Goodness me, get myself a girlfriend? I never heard of such a crazy idea. Huh? Oh dear, seems like rain again. I better hurry up. Guess I should have asked for more detailed directions or brought a map. This fog. I can't see. I'm lost. Can't even see the river. I'd better think about turning back. Oh. But what way is back? Oi! Is anybody there? Oh! Guess I should have brought little Mai with me. Little Mai never ever gets lost. Mm-hmm. 
I've never seen anyone so beautiful. Find any gold up there, Snip? Listen! Listen! I'm talking to you! Oh my. Didn't you hear me, Snip? Please leave me alone. From that day on, Sniff took to walking up the mountain stream every day. What on earth has got into Sniff these days? The Hamulin told me yesterday he goes off every morning and doesn't return till nightfall. And he's done that every day for a week. Hmm. What could he be doing up there every day? <gasps> He's coming! Yes, he said he must find out why Sniff goes off every morning. Oh, he's pinched my idea. I was going to follow him myself. I'm sure we can leave it to Moomin to find out what's going on. There he is. Moomin, you've come back. Tell us then, what does he do up there all day on his own? He never brings back any gold. Moomin! Oh. Little my snort maiden. I'm sorry, I can't talk to you just now. I want to be left alone. You said we could leave it with Moomin to find out what was going on, didn't you? Yes, I did. How is he? saying leave me alone and he's not eating anything well he's just like sniff mmm this sounds extremely serious I can't imagine what could be happening to them up there in the north tomorrow I'll go find out for myself hey eh? oh no it's far too dangerous how do you mean dangerous one gets lost pretty easy up there and since we don't know what's come over them one must be very careful it's impossible to know what could happen when you got there 
This is a job for experience, for daring, and for cunning. Are you sure you'll be all right? Oh, don't you worry. I shall go by myself and I will be fine. Do be careful, Papa. A hurry, Moomin Papa. Can't tell you now. I'm too busy following those two over there. Following them? But whatever for? There's something serious afoot. Come back here, you two! up to. He locked himself in his room as soon as he came back home. How stupid! He should have let me go instead, obviously. Oh. Moomin, Papa, the salt? <sighs> the salt, please! Eh? What was that, little mud? I'd like some salt, if you please. Oh. Huh? I've had enough. But the dessert! I've had enough too. Mama, I'm going to find out what's behind all this. So am I. Why don't you come with us, Moom and Mama? I don't know. Whatever it is, they're very secretive about it. So maybe we shouldn't ask too many questions. But Moomin didn't have any dessert. This is really serious. Yes, true. Hello there. Where are you off to? The secret place up north. Up north, you said. Could I come along with you? Not you too. I've seen them all going there. I've been wondering what on earth it's all about. It sounds very serious. Yes, there's something happening up there in the north. It seems to cast a spell on them. It's unsettling. Could it be something up by the stream in the north? Yes. Oh, I see. Snufkin, do you know anything about it? Well, not exactly, but don't worry about it, Moomin Mama. They will get over it soon enough. It's getting foggy. I can't see a thing. Wait. Wait for me, please. I'm afraid I can't walk that quickly. I'm older than you. I can't hear the river. We've lost our way. Huh? Where are you off to? You heard something? Something tells me it's this way. It's a pond! And there they all are! Look! There's my brother, too! What are they looking at? Oh, my! What can you see, Mr. Hamulin? <sighs> so tell us, what can you see? Shh! Quiet! It's a nymph! A nymph? Oh, how beautiful! 
beautiful she is. Where is that nymph? I can't see anything. Little Mai. What? Little Mai, come here at once. Little Mai. Where is she? I can't see anything. <gasps> oh. What's it all about, Mr. Hemulin? The nymph went away because Little Mai made such a racket. Tomorrow she'll be back. I hope so, Moomin Papa. Moomin? The news about the beautiful water nymph spread all over Moomin Valley. This water nymph has created a crisis for all the women of Moomin Valley. Only men would be stupid and gullible and foolish enough to see something that isn't even there. Listen, women of Moomin Valley, how do we drive it away? Mm, oh, my, what should we do? Only one way, if you ask me. And what is that, then? That silly nymph lives in the little pond, doesn't she? So we get rid of her, right? Mm, my goodness, you're that? very unkind. She likes the little pond. Do you have a better idea, Mama? Perhaps we could wait a bit longer. But we women have been downtrodden for too long. Don't you see that, Moomin Mama? I like little Mai's idea. Let's go and fill that pond once and for all. All right, let's get going. Tomorrow yes, we move with spades and shovels and pickaxes. Pond's disappeared. Uh oh. No, oh. no. <laughs> Woman, what happened? The beautiful nymph went somewhere else when the pond disappeared. I dreamt about her last night. So did I. She was so beautiful, so beautiful. She might never have existed. She could have been an illusion. Illusion? You noticed that none of the women could see her, Inspector. Oh, an illusion. I always knew men had more imagination. Must say, I would like to dream about her now and then, though. And as for the rest of us, I guess we'd better try and forget about her. She wasn't really any more beautiful than Mumble. Ah! Oh, is, is this the same pond? pond? Look at that! Where is the water gone? Oh, that rain must have washed it away. Little Mai, is this the pond you talked about? Uh, morning, ladies. Where are you off to? You look as if you're going to dig for gold. We women were on our way to fill up that pond. You were? You ladies? 
And what's so funny, Moomin Papa? <laughs> Forgive me, but the thought of all you women trying to fill up the pond with shovels and spades and axes. <laughs> Are you still sick? I'm fine. Oh, you're better! <laughs> Mumble, I'm sorry I neglected you for so many days. Oh, my dear, I'm so glad you're better. Mumble. Well, let's get back, everyone. I'm ever so hungry. Well, yes. it was nice I while it lasted. <laughs> yeah. You were right, Snufkin. It did pass. They say the water nymph appears around this time of the year in small temporary rock pools, though I never believed it. I think she's an illusion. Well, I looked hard and I didn't see her. Ah, uh, I guess only men see that special illusion. Falling in love is bad enough, but with an illusion? Don't you agree, Snufkin? Well, for myself, I think I'll stick to fishing. Where the beautiful water nymph went? And whether she even existed, no one knew. And maybe that was just as well. <laughs>